Right, so I'm uh, creating a video here to show how we can use conditional formatting to flag when things are overdue or uh, when things are coming due um, based on inspections for whatever reason that you need a due date and a flag for that due date. So this example I pulled from my current job uh, we have these things called gauge blocks and ring gauges that have to get measured uh, once per year and we have to know their known size in micro inches so um, you can see here I put in some fake dates here we have two that are overdue that were due October 1st 2015 and we have another one that's coming due so I want to use conditional formatting to uh, to flag those visually so I can see that they're overdue and the way we do that <clears throat> is you highlight all the cells you want the conditional formatting you go to the home tab and you go over here to conditional formatting and you're gonna go manage rules now we're gonna create two rules one for when they're overdue and one for when they are coming due 30 days we'll say so we're gonna go new rule format only cells that contain a cell value less than and so for the first one we'll do now this is gonna flag it if it's past the current due date and then we're going to click format and this will be the format that's applied now I want to fill and I want red so we'll go OK and OK and then we're going to want another rule that's going to tell us when something is coming due so again format only cells that contain cell value less than we're going to go equals now open and close parentheses plus 30 and that's for 30 days and the format we'll pick on this will be yellow now I want the red one on top because it has a higher precedence so I'm going to put this yellow one down below it and I'm going to hit OK and now you can see hey it's flagged these three here are overdue and this one November 1st because it's October 11th right now is within that 30 day period so this is just a great way you can use conditional formatting I mean there's thousands of ways um, this is a good way you can do it there's a whole variety of uses whether it's you know an oven that you have come do car inspections um, anything that requires some sort of flag or some sort of due date and something that where you can express that in a sheet here so uh, that's how we use it at my current job it's a great system and hope that helps thanks